Hello to all my viewers. This is Dr. Dawal Mehta and today we will understand heat map in orange. Heat map is a graphical method for visualizing attribute values in a two-way matrix. It only works on data sets containing numeric variables. The values are represented by color according to the select selected color palette. By combining class variables and attributes on x and y axis, we see where the attribute values are the strongest and where the weakest, thus enabling us to find the typical features for each class. Now let's see how we can generate heat map on orange. So we'll go on the canvas of the orange and the first widget which will activate is a file widget. Just click once. Now double click on it. You can browse your own data sets from here or the sample datasets can be activated from Browse Documentation Datasets. Click on it. In this, we are having the dataset iris.tab. Click on it and press Open. Now you can see here the name of the variables. Sepal length, sepal width, petal length, petal width, and iris. The thing which you should note is they are all numeric. And the target variable iris is categorical. The values are iris setosa, iris versicolor, iris virginica. Now close this. We want to generate the heat map. So you will go in the visualize and click on the heat map and connect it. Now double click on it. Your heat map is ready. So from the color, the options available are you can have a linear, diverging, color blind, color blind friendly and others. In linear, the range is that is from 0.1 to 7.9 the range this range is of the values of this iris setosa iris versicolor and iris virginica now activate the diverging from here and what can be the center let's say we fix the center as 4 so you will see the difference okay you can see the colors are diverging from the center at present, keep it 0.00, .00 enter. We can merge by key means, click on it, or you can remove the click. Clustering can be done row wise or column wise. Uh, Splitting can be done if there is a categorical variable. At present, keep the things as it is. Now, if you require any annotations, this can be done. Just a minute. Uh, go in row annotations. The annotations can be done according to iris. So it displays the name of the, uh, it, it will display the values like iris setosa, iris virginicolor, and iris versica. You can also have a row uh, annotations according to the sepal length. So it displays the figures. So at present, get none. Color. Okay. Column annotations can be done. Top. Bottom. Top and bottom. Activate the keep aspect ratio. Or you can remove it. The next thing which you can do is click on this, right click, zoom in and zoom out. If you want to come on the original size, zoom to fit. So this was all about how to plot heat map in orange. For more videos on data mining using orange, kindly subscribe to my channel. You can refer my playlist in which I uploaded videos on data science, machine learning and artificial intelligence. Please don't forget to like and share my videos. You can also follow me on different social medias. Link given in the description box.